everybody and welcome back to my studio. It's good to see you all here. Um, I wanted to just go into a little bit of detail about how I painted the boat in this painting here. I painted this a couple of months ago. Um, this is a lesson on MJS TV. Um, there's a link in the pop-up there um, or indeed in the description below. Um, it's a full lesson on, on MJS TV. Every aspect has been covered. Uh, it's hours and hours of footage. So if you want to learn how to paint this in detail, then go and visit that. But I'm going to show you just in this video how I've done the boat. So um, let's get painting. I'm going to start probably from this point here and then work down on the boat. Um, and then we'll put the masts in and then all of the rigging. So now we're going to move over to the canopy, get the sharp point on the rigger brush, and we're going to try and get that line correct, going across there. We need it to be fairly straight. And then it runs down just a little bit in the diagonal as it goes over that part of the window. Dark edge to the left here rolls over the top very slightly. frame some of these darker areas that are just at the top there. I'm not going to worry too much just yet about all the rigging and all the, the uh, other smaller details within that. Now if you're painting over something slightly darker and that paint's wet, you do need to exaggerate the light a little bit. So mix something that's probably lighter than it needs to be. Um, and then that way, when you sit over the top of the, the dark color, you're not fully losing it. And then in this part here, this darker area that we've put in, we've got various other little bits. Not Once again, not sure what they are. Just going to now work on this part here, um, continuing with that same blue that we were using. I'm going to go right up to that brown line that we can see. The window there has a, ever such a slight edge to it, darker edge, just on the inside of the frame.
right, so now I'm going to start working on the blue just underneath that. Okay, we can also probably move over to a slightly different brush, something a little bigger. So back to the Series 7 size 8. share of the colour in, we can refine it in a minute. So that's most of it in, what we now need to do is go back to a smaller brush and make sure that we've got that, all those details in there properly. There aren't many details on that but they are there. three times because it's barely touching the panel. working on the rigging now. We have our thinner which we're going to be using a lot more for the rigging than we did for other parts of the painting and the brushes that we're going to be using are the rigger brushes and that is series one size zero and series one size one. Obviously we'll be using the one size zero for the smaller um, for the rigging and we'll probably use this bigger one, the size one for the masts. Now the first thing to do, I 
I think, is to get the masts in. And then once we have those masts in place, we're then gonna know precisely where we need to put the rigging. Now I just need to work out where the mast stops because obviously we've blocked in um, and well, we've gone over with the oil. Um, can't quite see where that's supposed to stop even by looking at the photograph. So one thing we probably can do is to see where this here meets the mast. Get a straight edge. I'll just use this piece of wood here. In fact, no, we can probably use, oh no, we'll use this piece of wood. And I'm just gonna run a pencil line all the way up here, running along that line up to the top, which is about there. Right, let's just see how that is before we yeah, I'd say that was pretty good. So now what we need to do is get, go back to our straight edge and we need to get this in the right place. So all I'm doing is I'm lining the straight edge up with the mast. Now I know that looks in the video, it might look slightly off, but it is correct. So and then what we do is we'll, I'm going to do a one continuous line from the top all the way down. some of the rigging. We do actually have another one quite low down, don't we? I'd say it's probably about this height. And it comes out level with this point here. I would say there, that's the start and the finish. Let's practice getting in the right place. I think what we'll do now is we're gonna start on the rigging for this mast here. In order to thin that line down a bit more, we're going to thin the paint down more and that's going to allow just the very tip of the brush to be used. Let's thin the paint down a bit more. And it's really important that there's only the very tip of the brush that touches the panel. We can adjust that if need be, what we've just done. And then we've got another area of rigging that then comes down to this point here from the top. So it's that. there. Make sure it's going to go in the right place, which it does seem to be. Okay, so we seem to have some more cables, more rigging coming from this spot there, which comes down from the other mast. skinny the line could have done possibly with being a bit darker. Let's just continue. Mm -hmm. 